As you can see, it's 45 foot Young's Brothers. All cleaned up. It's got its rack for the gear. Open stern. The roof racks, life racks, the custom radar stuff. Let's see, we got all lighting for night fit for night fishing. All the tanks are down below deck flow off the tanks. There's three tanks. You can see the hatches. Three by three hatches, three bins. You can hold about 10,000 pounds below deck. We got two 350 gallon fuel tanks down below deck. Nice big hatch in the back to get in for the steering and the stern. So you're walking up, get our lobster tray right here with all your stuff for it, banding, the front guys, the pollen station. You get a full setup of spare electronics in your outside station, open window. And you're walking with a wheelhouse, you get your captain's chair, closed off area, it's all heated. Now I spare another set of electronics. You can see from your from your station. Full controls. Clear view windows. Bunks with all storage down below the bunks. <coughs> uh, electronic station on the controls. And you got your, your bathroom in here. The toilet controls are all redone, refresh you for five last. Most of the fittings in the boat are all stainless steel. What hasn't has been zinc coated. Everything else is through bolted. Nothing screwed. Stainless steel everywhere. Like I said, it's all through bolted. There's no screws everywhere, so nothing comes loose on the boat. You can see that's the engine hatch in the wheelhouse. Some custom stainless steel pistons for easy access. The engine room is downstairs. There's the 2000 series Detroit, 800 horsepower. Um, continuous use, twin turbos, blower. Engine room is as clean as upstairs as it's immaculate. All lighted downstairs. Like I said, everything, all the fittings are stainless steel. And it's everything down there is clean. Oil pump right there, which comes right for the transmission and the, the motor. For easy access, it's all electric. Yeah, for outside electronics, you have your Richie's compass, your Furuno GPS, um, your GPS, and you have your standard VHF radio, and you have your North Star, and over here you have your depth gauge, and you have the spotlight operation from outside station. On the inside electronics you have a Raytheon radar daytime. You got you have your fish finder, your GPS plotter, which is a Fruno, and your VHF radio, your Robinson autopilot, um, another North Star unit, and then your stereo system, which also is a 500 amp on it. Four Eclipse 500 watt speakers and a 10 disc CD changer. You also have your single sideband, which is a Furuno, and a control for your spotlights from the inside. Then we're in the back for the rudder. We have a stainless steel pistons, all stainless steel fittings again. Everything is immaculate downstairs, no rust, no, no wear anywhere. As you can see down the hole, plenty of access to work. And for the fuel tanks, that's your fuel tanks right over there, all fiberglass. And with full stainless steel fittings for those also. And they have tank tenders up front to see how much fuel is in them.